I couldn't do it. I'm sorry. I dropped something on the floor and it's dirty and I just have to use it. But these are clean. But, I mean, I wouldn't do that because obviously I'm going to clean it. So I can do this one. Or I can do this one. Which one? Okay. Alright. Perfect. I like that one too. Yeah, so I'm gonna just get, let me just get that set back real quick. Alright, um, so the needle size that we'll be using, um, so we'll be using a, a 16 gauge needle. But the jewelry is 18 gauge, I think. But, I mean, no, it's good that I'll have that little extra space, you know? Okay. Okay. Oh, get my gloves together. They're inside out. They are clean. I just um put them on earlier just to you know that didn't work. So I got my gloves. I mean yeah, I had them on earlier, but it was only for a little bit, so they're still clean. There we go. Okay. I'm gonna put my. I shouldn't have the gloves on when I was touching the jewelry. My hands are clean. My hands are clean. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm gonna put the gloves on. Okay. Get it around my bracelet. Okay. This one's probably with me. Oh. So I got them around my bracelet. Okay. And um, so um, I'm gonna be using this needle. Um, it's black. Um, but it's black. It's not black because it's dirty. It's black because um. That's how I bought it. I'm sorry, what? Is it clean? Yes, it's clean. Only because it's not in the packaging. Yeah, no, it's perfectly clean. I clean it myself. You know, I it's in the needle too. I even used it when I pierced. Um, I mean, not this one. Um, not this specific one. I used a different one. Pierce. Anyways, so now I'm just gonna um, take this alcohol. I'm just gonna take this alcohol and I'm gonna put a little, um, I'm gonna clean your jewelry with it. And I know, like, um, they say you shouldn't um, clean your piercings with like alcohol or peroxide or whatever because it dries them out. But I'm not putting it on your skin. I'm only putting it on the jewelry, and this is to clean the jewelry, so it's perfectly fine. I've done it all the time. I mean, I've done it a lot. I'm just gonna take that. That's the top. I'm just going to take a Q-tip. I mean, of course, I cleaned the jewelry beforehand too, but you're asking questions like, is, is the needle clean? So, of course, I'm gonna make sure to clean everything in front of me so you know, you know, I run a clean establishment here. Thank you. So we got that all nice and clean. I'm gonna take your jewelry. And I'm gonna all clean. See? Now that's clean. Now I'm gonna take the needle and I'm just gonna stick it in this alcohol as well. I know this is touching I know this is touching your skin, but I mean, um you'd rather be clean, right? Exactly. So 
I'm gonna set that right there, okay, and just to protect myself from any blood, I'm just gonna put my a face mask on, just to be on the safe side. I'm not saying, you know, your blood's gonna spatter or splatter or shoot out. I'm not saying that's gonna happen. I'm just saying, just in case, I'm protecting myself. I don't know what you have. I mean, that's not rude, it's the truth. Would you want me to splatter my blood all over you? Okay. You made the right decision coming here, though. I'm really good. Okay. Oh. Um. Before we start, hang on one second. I shouldn't have put all this on just yet. Um. Before we start, because every time you know I do a piercing, you know, I'm putting a needle through someone's body. You know, I need, I need a little drink. You know, I need to relax. So I got me some nice little, a little travel size. You know, I'm going to take this on the plane with you. Um, this has, is, uh, I don't know. But yeah, I'm not going to drink the whole thing. Don't worry. I'm just going to take a little sip. Oh, did you want a sip? You can have a sip. See, it's so smooth. Did you want a sip? Not for me. No, because I didn't even do anything in these, so why would I switch gloves when I didn't even use these? These are still clean. Would you like take off your pants, you know? Or would you throw your pants in the dirty clothes just because you had to pull them down when you went to the bathroom? Exactly. That's all I'm saying. in the dirty clothes just because you pulled them down, right? Exactly. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and put my face mask back on. Ooh. Okay. Alright, are you ready? Are you ready? I'm ready. Oh, okay. So I'm going to take these cotton uh, cotton pencils. Excuse me. Sorry, I'm getting a little nervous. I just got the hiccups. I think it was from drink, taking a sip of the alcohol. I probably shouldn't have done that, but it's too late now. Anyway, I'm just going to go ahead and take these cotton rods. And I'm just going to clean your lip. Um, I know I said I wasn't um, going to use the alcohol, but... I just realized the alcohol is all I have, and we want to make sure that area is clean. And we all know alcohol will clean the area, so I'm just going to take my alcohol and my cotton swab. That's just the cotton swab. So, yeah. I'm going to take some of this. Get a little bit. Okay. And just close your mouth. Um, you, have, you have a big bottom lip, so could you just fold, like, go like this, the cotton. There we go. Thank you. Okay. 
Your whole, this whole area is real, is extra clean. I also think I have some um, old foundation, but it doesn't look like you have on any makeup today. It's just from today. Don't worry, girl. It's none of my business. If you don't want to tell me, it's none of my business at all. Okay. So you look all clean right there. I'm just going to take my little. And I'm just going to make a duck. Perfect. Okay. Now, this is the fun part. Are you ready? Okay. Your forehead. Okay. I'm just going to pull your bottom lip out. I'm going to show this through. You ask a lot of questions. Um... If you wanted to see how other peer, if you wanted to talk about how other piercers pierce people, you should have went to another piercer then. But you're here now, okay? You're about to get this done, and you already paid me, so. Yeah. So just relax, okay? Ready? Okay. Okay. I'm ready, too. Thanks. You didn't ask, but I just wanted to let you know. Here we go. Okay, I'm just gonna put grip on the needle. And maybe I should go from the bottom. Huh? Whatever, we're here now. I'm just gonna go from here. And okay, are you ready? I'm scared. Okay, but we're gonna do this together, okay? Ready? Count of three. Well, you don't count three. I count three. Okay. One, two, Oh my god, what the hell? I'm about to edit that out as well. Okay. I'm like, we're past 10 minutes. There's been like three fire trucks. What the fuck, man? I'm just trying to paint it to where you gotta come. Okay. Okay. I'm really proud of myself because I didn't know I could do that. Okay. Um. I need to get. I forgot to take the ring off of that piercing to put this in your. Do you mind holding the needle in your lip for me, please? Thank you. Just hold it right. Just hold it right there. Okay. I'm just gonna take your needle or your jewelry and take. Uh, oh my goodness, is it coming off? Okay. Oh, you're not wearing the hoop. This is the wrong jewelry anyway. Girl, why didn't you tell me? You was about to let me put that hoop in your lip and you was gonna be mad. It's a good thing I remember. Okay, I'm just gonna take off. I just took off the little, you can't see this one in my gloves, because my gloves are too big, but that's okay, too. Okay. And I'm just going to take it and follow it um, through. Seems like that. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, these aren't the same size. Sorry, I accidentally took it out of your lip. Okay, I'm gonna get the jewelry through. I'm sorry, okay. Yeah, 
I just took the jewelry out of your lip. I didn't, or not the jewelry, the needle out of your lip without putting the jewelry through. So we're gonna try this again, okay? And then I'm just gonna. Using the cotton swab on your lip to hopefully soak up any blood. Okay, so that's back through. Now we're just gonna put the jewelry. Oh, you went ahead and got that in there for you. And it looks amazing. Um, well, I can go ahead and take this off. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and tell you how to clean it. So how you'll clean it, um, you can um, get some Listerine. It doesn't matter what kind. Just get some Listerine and make sure you do some, um, you just gargle with it, let it sit in your mouth for a second. And then you'll also wanna do um, sea salt soaks. But, um, I mean, if you can't find sea salt, then regular salt should work just as well. And yeah, you just mix it with some hot water and you'll just gargle that and soak it on your lip. Yeah, you'll put it in a cup and soak it. You already know, girl. I don't even know why I'm telling you anything. Um, trying to think what else after care. Definitely, um, you'll want to get um, some Q-tips and dip it in that salt mixture and, you know, just clean the outside. Yeah. Definitely want to clean that. Um, any crusties, um, um, pus is normal. So if you notice, like, there's some white pus coming out, that's normal, and that means you know it's cleaning itself. Also, um, if it starts getting red, that's normal as well. Yeah, but I mean, you can always come back here if you felt like you know. Yeah, I'm just okay. Did that hurt any? Oh, yeah, it's good. Yeah, it's definitely good. It's a little red right now, but I mean, obviously, you did just get a needle shot through it. <laughs> Girl, but, okay, well, is there anything else I can do for you? Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming in today. Make sure you let your friends know about this place, too, because um, we have great deals on piercings and... Yeah, I could do their piercings as well. You like yours, right? Oh, you haven't seen it. I'm sorry. Um, so, I actually don't have a mirror in here. I don't have, a, I thought I had a mirror in here, but I guess I don't. Um, so, I mean, like, you know, when you get in your car, you can pull out your phone. And you know, I got on selfie mode on it. Oh, you don't have your phone in here. Well, I mean, you know, when you get in your car, I'm sure there's mirrors in there. You can see them there. Yeah. Um, yeah, but to me, it looks really good. Yeah. But yeah, let your friends know about this place. Um, tell them to come on by. Um, we're also thinking about doing tattoos as well. So. If you'd like to get a tattoo, that should be something you definitely let me know that you'd like to do because I could definitely do that for you as well. Okay. Alright. Well, you have a nice day. Oh, girl, no problem. Thanks. Bye.